Hey guys, Jordan Moss again, and I'm playing uh, Pokemon Emerald because uh, Pokemon Chaos Black is a bit shit. Uh, it keeps really my save, and the emulator that I was using was the Visual Boy Advance, and it is pretty shitty. So I've been using a new emulator called the. Um, uh, uh, let's see, what is it called? It's called the Boycott Advance, and I quite like it, it's quite a good one. So basically we've just started off and Professor Oak, or whatever his name is in this one, uh, is in trouble by uh, 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 Wild Zigzagoon, Zigzagoon, how you like coon. And uh, so I picked my favourite Pokemon which was the Mudkip, and uh, I do like this emulator because um, as you can tell things run a lot faster, battle runs a lot easier, um, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite good indeed, yeah. Yeah, 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 very good, very, very good. Um, so yeah, it just says that. Uh, cheers, right, for moving in next door and stuff and stuff. So let's keep Pokemon, obviously. And I got a bit of a weird theme to these Pokemon videos, and this theme is that I um, have been thinking, and I would like to ask, like every couple of episodes um, ask like a theme like a theme a question big question and then like you comment in the comments and like try and answer my question so question for this episode is not you know the most cheerful things but it is still a question and so if any of you read newspapers or stuff like uh, watch the news or stuff um, You'll know that there's been recent, you know, news on the burglary system in the UK, and the burglary system, as, as it stand, as it stood, was that if someone threatened you, uh, it broke in, and threatened your life, then you could only use reasonable force, right? So basically, someone could run in, steal all your stuff, and you can't stop them, or you get arrested, right? Um, and that's a bit pathetic. So the new law is that if it's breaking chairs you can use reasonable force to stop it and that's a bit stupid because reasonable force is something that might be blowing in or the big as ever and in my, my opinion that's what I'd do too I'd, if someone tried to rob me I would go oh yeah my xbox is in there my hd tv's in there my laptop's there yeah. and you know my pc my, my stereo you know inch plasma screen TV is over there and, you know just just take it you know Bobby on and there's some there's money in the draw you know I wouldn't really say that um so I'd like to ask your opinion what would you do if someone you know came into your house started trying to was, was trying to burglar you like threaten your loved ones or threaten to kidnap your loved ones or start stealing your stuff what would you class as reasonable force uh so you just comment below and that'd be great um so that's the question for this video, that is a bit morbid, you know. Asking if you'd kill a burglar if he, saw, if he rob, tried to rob you, so it's a bit depressing, but uh, what can be done? What can be done? Hey, hey, hey. So yeah, so there's going to be a question every video, if you want to want me to ask one of your questions, just uh, comment it. And your wish is my command. Ah, uh, uh. ah. Uh, so the theme of the next video, it's uh, quite an interesting one if you are into science like I am. Um, if you're not, I don't know, you You probably might find it a bit interesting, you might not. Um, so for the next video, I'm not going to tell you, so I just want to know um, what you think of my Q&A times here. Like, if you appreciate it, kind of thing. Um, 
So what I'm doing here, I after I've asked this obviously I've just asked this question just to cheer everybody up a bit in case it was a little bit depressing. This is you see that girl up there, that's your rival in the game, well she's your neighbour your fighter. And um well yeah, I'm just training up my mudkip to level seven because she only has a level five and that's very very easy to kill. So the reason I'm doing Emerald is because it was one of my favourite games and it probably still is one of my favourite games because it's like Ruby and Sapphire had a baby kind of thing. Um so that it has I'm not sure too short sure of the storyline because I only ever played Sapphire, but I do I did play this a bit and I did enjoy this quite a lot. Um so yeah. Um this is not this this episode in a live commentary because I didn't know what I was doing. Um at first, but now I know what I'm doing, so every other commentary will be live. Um so yeah. Today's the twenty fourth of the sixth 2011, so that's 24th of June, and I just checked my Pokemon, heal my Pokemon here, and uh, so today, two episodes or three episodes should be uploaded, depends on when I feel like going to Fallout New Vegas, so, yeah. I hope you enjoyed the last video, though, by the way, it took me about half an hour to upload and about two hours to fucking make, um, because when I'm making it, it just, like, I had to... I had to uh, save it as a HD format, so I had to export it as HD format, otherwise it would just be like 24KB and not upload. Like, oh, you fucking I need to laugh, I'm not uploading this for you. Um, yeah. So, she picked Trico because uh, she's my nemesis. So, it's very important that you train not just one Pokemon. So, like, you saw, you see how I saw that hyena, uh, hy hy hyena, or whatever its name is. Uh, I will be catching that later, and I'll be training that to probably the same level as Mudkip, which will probably be about level 30, um, hopefully, because I've got a gym later on, so I can use, I can train up uh, Mudkip quite well there. Yeah. Doo -doo -doo. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know if any of you guys are into films and stuff. But, has anyone seen The Hurt Locker? Uh, if you have, comment and like. Aside from the question, obviously. If you don't want to, you don't have to. But comment and tell me what you thought of it, because I think it's a very, very good film. For the, the awards it won, it was amazing. Um, I quite enjoyed it. It was thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyable. Definitely worth the watch if you haven't watched it already. I suggest that you should watch it. It is like a recommendation from me. I would uh, say that you should watch it because it is very, very good. A bit boring. It does drag on a little bit, just a little bit though, because it is two hours and like a, a couple of about fifty minutes long. So anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, um, like, and favorite, and have a very good day, guys. Thank you.